What's up everyone, Josh Wiseman here, AKA JT Wise Guy. If you're a first time viewer of this channel, welcome. If you're a returning viewer of this channel, welcome back. Let's cue the intro. I don't have an intro yet, so we'll just hop right into it. Today, the topic of discussion is going to be what every single creative, or individual for that matter, needs to know. Disclaimer, I am guilty and have been guilty of these things very recently, so it's okay. It's okay. Everybody deals with this kind of stuff in the creative community, and I want to just pass this along as a little tidbit of information to you guys. Essentially, this one topic of what every creative needs to know can be broken down into three categories. So, with that being said, number one is stop comparing your work to everybody else. Now you may be asking yourself, okay, so I'm looking at the best of the best and I'm comparing my stuff to them and that's where I wanna be at, like how does that make sense? Okay, so there's a huge difference between comparing your work to other people or pulling inspiration from other people's work who you may look at as better. And the biggest part of that is not comparing your work to other people because of the fact that like you could easily get down on yourself, which I definitely have done being in this community. There's so many, so many amazing artists and creatives that are just kicking out just amazing content day after day after day after day. And I'm over here just like, well, let me just, uh, okay, I'm not doing that. So now, not only is that putting me in a bummed out mood, but it's also stopping my growth and progression. And growth and progression in this industry is something that is huge because everyone's constantly always trying to look for the next best thing or the next thing that's gonna break or develop some sort of new style, but you can't do that. You can't do that. The more energy and effort and focus you put into someone else's work, the less attention your own work and less energy and less focus is gonna be put towards your own personal growth in your work. Second thing, is this gonna focus? Focus, focus, yes. Second thing on that list, talking about focus, people are very similar to lenses. And a good way to look at this is that. I like to look at it. People are like lenses. Let's just say in this hand you have a 35 mil and in this hand you have like a nice 18 mil or something like that. Basically, those two lenses serve the same purpose, to be creative. But this person over here with the 35 might do portraits and this person over here with the 18 might do landscapes. Essentially, the point that I'm trying to make is we all may serve a similar function but our focuses are different. And that kind of ties back into the first point of, you can't compare your work to other people. Everyone's style is developing, your style is developing, my style is developing, everybody is gonna be different. Now tying into the third point that I'm trying to make here with this entire what every creative needs to know, including myself, I need to practice what I preach more, is remember why you started because 99.9% .9 of us can get wrapped up in media, social presence, uh, popularity, fame, whatever you recognition, whatever you wanna say, but never forget why you started, never forget where you came from, because when you're feeling down on yourself, look at a photo that you took from a year ago or however long you've been doing this. Look at one of the very first photos you took. Look at one of the very first videos you took. Social presence will come, but never forget where you started. It's really easy to look at this guy and look at that guy or look at this girl and look at that girl and say like, man, like I really wish I was there. But guess what? By the time you get there, they're gonna be somewhere else. So are you still always gonna compare yourself to them? Let's hope not. Because like I said in the beginning, it takes that effort and that focus away from what you're trying to do with your own personal brand and your own personal style. And everyone in this community wants to see everybody grow, always wants to see people progressing and wants to just see people bring the content and deliver this content in a way that is unique to them. All that being said, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments what you're thinking about videos or if you wanna see something in the future, stay creative and I will see you guys next week.